when I first started, I was only I, I was only a youngster, and you only be allowed to go in the afternoons, because you wouldn't be allowed to go in the mornings. And you just get up and you walk down over the hill, because we lived up over Harris Hill up that way. And we go down and you take the little 25 foot boat and you go down the water, down and over down, by down back of Barings or there stairs is Cove. That's where you used to always tie in. Because it was before the, the long wharf and everything, then that was all still piers. Yeah. Right? They were only just starting to develop it. 50s. Late, late 50s, early 60s. Mm. Right? I was born in 54. So, and then you go down and get aboard, you go on down the battery, and, and that's how we went back and forth. Go down and get aboard the boat, and go down the harbour, and anchor her off down the battery, or put her in the side of the wharf, or yeah. head, of the, head of the wharf. And when I, like I was 10 year old when I started prying a fish out of a boat, and by myself too, yeah. and you probably had eight or 10,000 pounds of fish, you went to prying it up on the wharf, yeah. and, and no one was getting down to help you, you yeah. prying it up on the wharf. And then you get up and you fill up the boxes, and that was coming from one boat on the wharf, put on in a box, prying in a box, you had six men, and then it was shoots, bring it down, and now that caught a fish, then you leave that, then you go over and tie in the jobs. Yeah. Right? Yeah. yeah. You know? <laughs> work. Work? That's the ending on that when it comes to fishing is work. You got, you got to realize something. I'll tell you what my father said. It's not every year more skills a cow. You put the time in, you put the effort in, you look after your gear, maintain it, you reap the reward. But if you think you're going to be lax the days of you fishing, you're going to starve to death. Yeah. You've got to punch your dues and do your time. Even with the, 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 the day's technology. Yeah. Well, yeah right? The day's technology. Yeah. And they can pinpoint everything. I still... And my brother, we still use landmarks. When we're fishing our cod, we use the same landmarks for the fine pieces of ground that our father and our grandfather used. They're more reliable than sounders and then, Yeah, and the technology that's out there. Yeah, because yeah. they had it down to what yeah. point. We have it there. Yeah. We know how to use it. Yeah. But when we can see the land and, and whatnot, we know we got to have this rack over this point, this tree, over this point, and probably Coppice Cove, around, yeah. around Small Point. We know when we close them in, we know we're on, we don't need to go here or there, we know. And we still use the same technology, you know, even though we got it. 